Hull of Rails. It refers to deviation of rails in horizontal plane from its original intended position, measured individually for each of the rail with reference to a chord of specified length. Though, anchor length LA, the length of track required to resist the pull exerted on rails by the rail tensor at temperature TP. For practical purposes, it is taken as equal to 2.5 meters per degree Celsius of TOTP. If T0 is not known, TD can be assumed as T0. Thin. Blanket. The layer of granular material provided between ballast and subgrade formation on full width of formation. 4. Breathing length. The length at each end of LWR CWR, which is subjected to expansion contraction on account of temperature variations. Patch. Buckling of track. Sudden or gradual shifting of track in lateral or vertical direction due to unbalanced thermal stress in rail track is called buckling. Che. Can't deficiency. Can't deficiency occurs when a train travels around a curve with a speed higher than the equilibrium speed. It is the difference between the theoretical can't required for such higher speed and actual can't provided. Sat. Can't excess. Can't excess occurs when a train travels around a curve with a speed lower than the equilibrium speed. It is the difference between the actual can't and the theoretical. Can't required for such a lower speed. Arc. Can't gradient and can't deficiency gradient. It indicates the amount by which can't or deficiency of can't is increased or reduced in a given length of transition e.g. 1 in 1000 means that can't or deficiency of can't of 1 mm is gained or lost in every 1000 mm of transition length. 9. Catch sidings. Catch siding is a safety siding, taking off from the mill line and of a suitable length. Provided with devices such as rising variable grades and sand drags to fully absorb the velocity head attained by an inefficiently controlled train or part of train being pulled up therein, without being wrecked. It is essentially a gravity catch siding provided on long steep grades between stations, where curves are designed for a lower speed than may conceivably be attained by a train or part of a train which for one cause or another may have got out of control and when it is necessary to protect a station from uncontrolled trains or parts of trains liable to enter it. At any station situated in the immediate neighborhood of an incline steeper than 1 in 80 falling towards the station, a catch siding should be provided if necessary. The takeoff points to a catch siding should normally be set and locked for the siding, except where required to the trail through. Page 21 of 419 Centrifugal Force The outward force acting on a vehicle while moving on a curved track. Its magnitude depends upon the velocity of vehicle, mass and radius of curvature. Gyara Cold Weather Patrol the patrolling of track carried out during the period in winter when rail temperature is significantly lower than stress-free distressing temperature. Bara consolidation of track. The process of building up ballast resistance to the tendency of movement of sleeper either initially before laying LWR CWR or making up subsequent loss of resistance. Tera cross level. It is the level difference between two rails, on a sleeper, of a track. For the measurement of cross level, one of the rails is taken as reference to define the level of other rail. Chauda crossing angle. It is the angle contained between the gauge lines of the crossing. Usually defined by the number of crossing, which is cotangent of angle of crossing. Pandra crossover. A device to connect two lines by using two turnouts and straight or curved track in between. Solar degree of curvature. The angle subtended at the center of the circular curve by a chord of 30.5 meters. Satra does stressing. An operation undertaken with or without rail tensor to secure stress-free conditions in the LWR CWR at the desired specified rail temperature. Athara equilibrium speed. 
The speed at which the centrifugal force developed during the movement of the vehicle on a curved track is exactly balanced by the current provided. On these gauge, it is the shortest distance between the gauge faces of rails of a track between two rails. It is usually measured at a level between 13 to 15 mm below the rail top. Beast GMT the total traffic carried on a line, expressed as the gross million tons of traffic GMT recorded and advised by the statistical branch of each zonal railway is on the 31st of March of every year is called the GMT of the line. It keeps hot weather patrol. The patrolling of track carried out during the period in summer when rail temperature is significantly higher than stress-free distressing temperature. By speed curve or the turnout curve. The curve beginning usually from the toe of curved switch and extending up to toe of crossing. Taste machine joint. These joints are fish platter joints, which are provided where zero gap is required between rail ends. Page 22 of 419-24, maximum permissible speed of the curve. The highest speed which may be permitted on a curve taking into consideration the radius of the curvature, actual can't, can't efficiency, can't excess and the length of transition. Pachis rail failure. A rail is said to have failed if it has fractured in track or it is considered necessary to remove it from track on account of defects other than those due to accidental damages due to buckling, king kang, derailments, abnormal wheel burns etc. Chubby's rail temperature. Temperature of the rail is recorded by an approved type of rail thermometer at site. It differs from the ambient temperature which is the temperature of air in shade at that place, as reported by the Meteorological Department. Indian railways have been divided into four rail temperature zones. Fig. Teen the Shamlav Chehov. Chapter 3 is a map showing the four temperature zones and the annual mean rail temperatures at all important places are shown in the map. A. Distressing temperature TD. The average rail temperature during the period of fastening the rails to the sleepers after the stressing LWR CWR without the use of rail tensor. If rail tensor is used, TD for all practical purposes is equal to T0. The range of TD at T0 shall be within the limits of rail temperature shown below. Temperature zone, rail section, range, I, though, 3. All sections TM to TM Jor 5 degrees C. If Bhavan kilogram prati meter or heavier TM Jor 5 degrees Celsius to TM Jor 10 degrees Celsius B. Installation temperature TI. The average rail temperature during the process of fastening the rails to the sleepers at the time of installation of SWR, LWR, CWR. C. Mean annual rail temperature TM. The average of the maximum and minimum rail temperature recorded during the year. TM is fixed locally wherever rail temperature records are available for a reasonable period of 5 years. Where rail temperature records are not available, TM can be read from the rail temperature map fig. 3.6 of chapter 3. D. Prevailing rail temperature TP. The rail temperature prevailing at the time when any operation connected with LWR such as the stressing etc. is carried out. A. Stress-free temperature T0. The temperature of rail in LWR CWR at which the rail is free of thermal stresses. Satai's rail tensor. A hydraulic or mechanical device used for stretching the rail physically. At highest rate of change of can't a rate of change of can't efficiency. It is the rate at which can't or can't efficiency is increased or reduced at the maximum permissible speed of the vehicle passing over the transition curve, e.g., 35 mm, means that a vehicle when traveling at a maximum speed permitted will experience a change in can't or deficiency of can't of 35 mm in each second of travel over the transition. Page 23 of 419-29 Sand Hump A sanded track, which works as an isolation, provided after loop lines to avoid collision with mail-line vehicles. 
Teased shift. An introduction of transition curve, laid out as a cubic parabola, causes May circular arc to move inwards by an amount called the shift. Teased slip siding. These are shorter length sidings located on the lower side of a station on steep grade, where there is a risk, whether owing to gradients or due to high wind velocity, of uncontrolled vehicles running out of stations from standstill or during shunting, fouling the mail line. These sidings take off from the mail line, outside all points, to prevent wagons breaking away from the station, entering into the block section. At any station situated in the immediate neighborhood of an incline steeper than 1 in 100 falling away from the station, a slip siding should be provided, if necessary, in a suitable position. The takeoff points to a slip siding should normally be set and locked for the siding, except where required to the trail through. Whenever, for any cause, it is found necessary to lay a slip siding off the mail line or off the through loop line, so that there is risk of whole trains getting trapped, the design of such a slip siding must be identical with that of catch sidings as already defined. But these stock rail joint SRJ. The joint of stock rail with the running rail at the approach. Tethys super elevation, say. Super elevation is the amount by which one of the rail is raised with reference to the other rail of a track. Chotis switch expansion joint, Sage. An expansion joint installed at each end of LWR CWR to permit expansion contraction of the adjoining breathing lengths due to temperature variations. Panthes symmetrical split. These are the turnouts where center line of track coincides with bisector of crossing angle. The radius of leg curve of symmetrical split turnout is twice the radius of ordinary turnout. Chhattis transition curve. An easement curve which has curvature change throughout its length, 37 turn in curve. The connecting curve starting after the heel of the crossing leading up to the adjacent track. Arthis turnout. It is a device to allow movement of train from one track to another track. The turnout consists of sub-assemblies of switch, crossing and lead. Depending on the side to which the train gets diverted, a turnout may be called left or right hand. Untali's twist. Twist is parameter, calculated by using cross-level values at two locations separated by a specific distance base. It is also defined as the rate of change of cross-levels in over a given base. Page 24 of 41940 Unevenness un of rails. It refers to deviation of rails in vertical plane from its original intended position, measured individually for each of the rail with reference to a chord of specified length. Iktalis Versen. Versen is the perpendicular distance measured at the midpoint of a chord from the arc of curved track. Bayali's vertical curve. A circular curve in vertical plane. Tertalis welded rails. A. Continuous welded rail CWR. ALWR, which continues through station yards including points and crossing. B. Long welded rail LWR. A welded rail, the central part of which does not undergo any longitudinal movement due to temperature variations. C. Short welded rail SWR. A welded rail that contracts and expands throughout its length due to temperature variations.